eight, nine, copy, delete. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Aya was a the Aya was up y'all. Matthew Ren here. It's uh, October the second at like twelve p.m. at noon. It's uh, noon. I can't let that go. Can't let that go. And I'm back playing more Blaster Match Zero. Blaster Match Zero. Blah, 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 blah. So uh, we're still on slot number seven here. And by the way, I um I copied over to slot number nine for. This is for insurance. Let's just, uh, let's just get this on. Well, not get this on like that, but you know. No, 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 not like that either. No, no, not like that. So yeah, last night I stopped in, uh, I stopped at this save point here in area seven and uh, Oh, really? We know what I can do. Not that. Yeah, you, you kind of have to be a little creative with your wall climbing. Like where you decide to... Am I going the right way? Oh, yeah. So you got two ways to go here. You can take either one. You see, it'll it'll lead you to the same place on the map there. Mm -mm -mm. I guess I'm going to take a. Let's take the long way around because why not? Maybe if I if I want to, I'll go back and show the other way. Even though there's really ain't no point because there's nothing that um. Uh oh. There really, there really ain't nothing else that uh, I could backtrack for. <laughs> Maybe I should have uh, left something for me to backtrack for. Because uh, the other trick here, the other thing I want to do, <gasps> I almost got cut up by that spotlight. <laughs> the other trick here is that uh, I want to leave an item for me. I want to, um, you know, before I beat the game, I want to, like, not get all the items intentionally because I would just want to show something. So, I'm going to have to, like, pick a cave to not, to, you know, intentionally not go into. Alright, alright, here we go. Man, y'all... Howdy, y'all. I'm just being my own naturally squirrely self. Yeah, because see, there's a... Um... All right, all right, all right. What the hell? Sheesh. The jacket off on me. So, yeah, you see, there's another cave. I think I will get this cave right here to the left of us. All you have to do is go into the lava fall here. And there it is. I guess that one is uh, more obvious than the health pack in Area 6. But whatever. Another pink pickup. Oh yeah, I got both of them with that one shot reflected back at the one of them. Uh. Yeah, more uh, more searchlight dudes. Ah, uh, and then you got these things. These blue ones you have to contend with on top of that. And that shit will that shit will create even more problems for you, so Oh man. This is like so <laughs> I did not get caught there. Sheesh. Oh 
oh, 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 oh. Yeah, if you get caught by the blue ones, some like metal slugs, some like slugs will pop out and start attacking you. A metal slug. Maybe that's what they were, they were going for. What is this right here? Oh yeah. These are S1000 generator. And they're weak to flame. I was about to try to experiment there, but looks like I guessed right. These things are easy. Well, I mean, I guess, I, oh wow, it's kind of fast. Oh, what the hell? Mm -mm. So I guess as long as you got this flame weapon, this flamethrower, just roast him. Is it going to be like this the whole thing? The whole fight? Oh. <laughs> well, shoot. I can imagine that can be uh, quite bothersome if you didn't have the flamethrower. But I do, and I get a life up for my trouble. Let me see here. Yeah, here's a uh, here's some more shutters that'll close on you if you get if you get caught by that light. It's not that the uh, you know those bugs are terribly hard to deal with; they're just kind of annoying. So you know, those homing missiles are so useful. There ain't nothing like them. Oh yeah, okay, so this room right here, this is the room where the other cave is down there. And uh, you gotta do some series of uh, wall climbs and all that, and wall runs. I'm gonna pass that by for now. I realize I'm gonna have I realize I, I am gonna to have to backtrack a great deal because of that, but hey. But oh but wait no. Shoot, I need to I need to go there because the the pickup I get there. Alright, never mind. Never mind, I guess I am going there. You know what? Maybe I'll show off that other thing. That thing in a different file. Because I do want to show it. Uh, 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 uh. Man, I hate the placement of those things sometimes. Sometimes. So yeah, it's down there. Ain't it? Um, so, uh, 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 what? I guess that ain't too bad. Well, it's a good thing I made that extra save file, and then, I guess. Oh, man. And you thought the other, uh, like, the this place is huge for... A little sneaking section. Um, man, how am I supposed to? Thing is, I don't want to like set off. I don't want. I don't want to have the other guys come after me. The pink guys. See, I just lost my wave. I haven't... <clears throat> that, that is one thing I do not want to happen. You know what? Just... Alright. 
I got my striker back, I guess. I'm gonna just feel my way around here. Because I'm gonna tell you right now. Oh, well. This also kind of, this, well, not this also, but because the, uh, the other time where I said this was Majora's Mask Randomizer, but this kind of reminds me of Pac-Man World 2. You know, those mazes. <clears throat> those times where you had to do like the classic mazes in some levels. This reminds me of, this reminds me of the, of the uh, volcano ones. The lava theme ones. With how it's laid out. Yeah, maybe I should. And here I go talking about, you know, games I I might want to LP. Oh, hey, he gave me another, whatchamacallit, oh, that's a bad spot. <sighs> okay. <laughs> As I was saying, here I go again about talking about games that I might want to LP. But man, I would kind of want to do Pac-Man World 2. And maybe though, we got we got the new um, Pac-Man World repack that just came out. I haven't bought it yet because I'm a little tired of money. You know, moving and all. But I've, I've never played the first uh, world game all that much on the original PS1. Um, one of them is like ahead of the other one. <laughs> oh my god, how did I make that? Yeah, there's a there's a bunch of other ways you can uh, uh, do that room, but I'm just glad I made it over here. So get yourself a bunch of refills. There's two, a big, um, there's two large gun pickups in here. So that should pretty much guarantee you that you get up to, um, yeah. Now this, for this boss, you can use the remote blast is always an option. Remote blast is always an option. I think you can take off like a third of its health with that. Maybe I might do that. <laughs> but another thing that I like doing is that you have it. Use the turret shot right here. Because I forgot what its weak. I want to say flame was its weakness. Or was it? Oh, I guess I'll. I guess I'm going to be experimenting. And Jason walks up. I'm not doing that, by the way. Venom Master. You know, this big motherfucker. Oh, that's his moderate weakness. Say, so he's gonna bring out these things. And there's the turret decoy at work. Let's throw the flame then. No? Is it this? What is your strong. There it goes. Uh oh. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, God, that's hitting me. Man, I thought it was a, I thought it was way out of range of that. I still have my spread shot. Miraculously. I swear, if I died right there. <laughs> Seriously, I was, I was just barely in the range of that shit. Oh. But yeah, that big old fuck you laser, I guess was a, I guess was a precursor to this. Acceleration Blast, release a huge amount of energy to attack. Sophia's most powerful weapon, hold the shooting but down to, to charge it, then release to fire. Really? What can you tell me, Eve? So this Acceleration Blast lets Sophia, I didn't know. I didn't know it was going to be uh, like that. By the way, 
Also, I never noticed that, um, I guess I use this feature so little that when you're, when you're out of the tank, it has like a whole different graphic for Jason, you know, and his helmet and all that. That's pretty cool. Acceleration Blast lets Sophia use all of its power in one concentrated super powerful blast, huh? It won't fire uh, unless your SP gauge is maxed out, but make no mistake, it has tremendous power. However, using it can be quite a burden in a number of ways. Only when the timing is right. Oh, yes. And, I, and let me tell you, let me tell y'all, we will be using it pretty soon here, or I'm, I'm going to be trying to use it. With um, probably some mixed results. Huh, so yeah, we got to get back out, uh, get back out of here by way of the same wall climbing stuff. Yeah, I'm glad I remember that when I came here. So, gotta get out of the tank for this. Can't take the tank with us. I mean, we're not like we can take the tank through here anyway. God, could you imagine if you could um, take the tank through the top down sections? And, like, I don't know. It's like, how would they? That'd be kind of cool. This place actually looks, it doesn't look as big as the other ones. At least it, this, um, this cave doesn't look as big as the last one we've been in. Oh, but there sure is a, god damn. That's a lot of niggas. What you say in Fire Emblem Maniac Mode? Maniac mode. How many soldiers there are? Oh, I could use some. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I could use some gun power ups too. But it looks like the game will not acquiesce. I don't even know how you're. Oh, blah, blah, blah. How are you even supposed to get past that left part there with those four guys and those spotlights? Like there ain't no- <laughs> I put down- oh well. <laughs> I forgot- <laughs> I was meaning to use the grenade, but then I forgot I was still on the turret. But then the turret ended up save saving me because it, it distracted the guards. That's amazing. <laughs> I never knew oh. really really so next time so if, if you have the turret you can distract the guards that way so you can get them off your back while you make your escape bro that's actually pretty cool oh man uh, careful fall damage better believe your ass will be booted back uh, if you uh, um hey there <clears throat> you gotta be kidding me this thing is alive get out of there now Jason that gargantuan mutant has been a has an extremely tough ar outer armor your, br your blaster right blaster <laughs> your blaster rifle won't even make a scratch on it Damn it, I don't know how I can beat this thing without Sophia. I gotta find a way. Skeleton, the planet eater. Nah, if that ain't some Final Fantasy shit right there. I don't know why that thing just, just doesn't lunge out and eat me up right there, like on the spot. How's the seed? Perfect. I'm heading your way now. 
Oh, that's lucky. I don't care how strong this how strong this thing's armor is. Sophia is gonna blast right through it. Yeah, right as soon as my SP recharges. Um And it looks like you have... Okay, so the trick here is, you can fight this thing. This thing is not, like, impossible to beat, like, without what I'm going to do right now. But I just want to do it. I have to wait for my... So, yeah, like Eve said, your SP has to be maxed out. And jump over this. Come on, come on, come on. It's done charging. Ready to fire, Jason. Take this! Beaten scum, acceleration blast! I love doing that. <laughs> I don't care how stubborn it may seem, I always do that. I always try to do that when, uh, when I'm fighting this thing. But it makes it harder if those rocks are broken from the start. Because those uh, the rocks that he's launching uh, can come right in and interrupt your interrupt you, and you have to jump over that energy blast. Oh, but yeah, I love doing that. I love doing that. And we're only 21 minutes in. Up ahead is where the ringleader, the mutant lord, is hiding, right? Yeah, no doubt about it. This time, I no we. Yeah, we. <laughs> we. What do you mean we? Nintendo we? Us? Are you talking about the movie? Anyway, we will put an end to this. Let's go, Jason. We? Why are you speaking in French? Okay, I'll stop. Uh, and there, uh, this music just keeps playing. This music only for cutscenes. Pretty nice. 